In this video, I'm going to teach you how to fix DirectX Error EAFC25. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm going to give you easy to follow instructions on how to properly address any issues that you might be having while trying to run or play EAFC25, primarily related to DirectX. So if you notice that you get an error message that has DirectX included, it is usually related to driver problems. So to start, I would recommend reinstalling DirectX. You will be able to download it on the official Microsoft website. So just look for DirectX Microsoft on Google and make sure that you are on the official Microsoft website. This way you will be able to get the safest installation possible. All that you have to do is run this setup. When you run this setup, you will be able to click that you accept the agreement, select next, and then proceed. I'm not gonna go through with the whole installation in this video, but all that you have to do is follow along. Once DirectX is updated, try running the game and see if you are able to open it or if it is stable. If it is still giving you trouble, the next thing to do is to right click the Windows icon, go over to Device Manager, and in here you will be able to find your graphics card. So under Display Adapters, you will be able to see if your PC or laptop has a dedicated graphics card. If it does, the first thing that you can try to do is to right click and then update the driver. I wouldn't recommend doing this unless you have something like integrated graphics. If you notice that you actually have a dedicated GPU such as an AMD Radeon or an Nvidia GeForce card, then what you can do instead is note down the model name. So in my case, it would be the 7900XCX and then just visit the appropriate website. In here, you will be able to select the option to download the drivers and you can either automatically detect your drivers or select the model here. So, Radeon RX 7000 series 7900 XTX. Most people have NVIDIA cards, so you go over to the NVIDIA website instead, you choose GeForce, and then you just go ahead and look for your specific product. So, 40 series, for example, and then you will be able to choose the specific model that you have to download the corresponding drivers. After you reinstall the graphics drivers and you update DirectX, you will be good to go. I hope I was able to help you on how to fix DirectX error EAFC25. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.